Retiming Physics, Evolution of Sensing Frequency. The evolution of the five senses consistently represented the detection of prey or predators at ever greater distances based on a higher signal frequency in hertz of environmental feedback, touch, taste, smell, hearing, and Whether vocal or telecommunication, the rule is that the higher frequencies travel farther with less distortion. Tuning into them gives one a greater early warning of friendly food or fearful foe. As new senses evolved, older senses continued to evolve like different lines of financial. In evolving senses, the physical process involved vibrations like the instrumental music in an orchestra. Each new sense expanded the distance which the organism could sense and respond to find some dinner or avoid With higher frequencies, the evolving five senses are like an orchestra with more sophisticated instruments. In all cases, the sensory vibration frequency increased as the sensing organism became more sensitive to the benefits and dangers of its environment. Whether a lowly single cell organism or highly human fools, the symphony of existence is evidenced in the music heard from near, afar, or within music distance. One of the most basic examples of touch prompting a survival response is a starfish having an arm bitten off and moving away. The initial sense was a pressure, touch, or bite. The large blunt instrument of touch was a sense by which the biological mass could move out of the way of pending demise. Otherwise, it did not pass on its limited musical talent. For evolution in the watery world led to development of sensing the predator or prey from cells slothed off into the water. Thus was taste added to sensory or With migration from water to land, Water tasting expanded to air tasting for molecules of food or death. While water currents were a few miles per hour, winds can carry scents farther and faster. Harsh or pleasant notes of survival travel faster on the winds. Sound evolved as a finer tuning of the predator or prey dichotomy in one's survival. At 600 miles per hour, sound was faster than smelling molecules as well as being able to travel against the wind, unlike the molecules of food or fear. One learned to associate certain sounds with certain outcomes, or died to end one's genetic musical. Can you feel music? Hearing evolved from the sense of touch. Auditory hairs evolved sensitivity to noise vibration. A tie to the past of touch is how noise becomes a pain above a certain decibel level. Fastest and finest of all early warning senses for greater probability of survival is eyesight. The visual sense uses the speed of light to forewarn a seer at 186,000 miles per hour. The evolutionary sensory progression of processing weaker, higher frequencies has been technologically extended by man in both the macro and the micro. Frequency concentration is like a pair of glasses helping one to read or like concentrating light to start a fire. The latter redirecting light waves together increases the power as well as the frequency of the focal point. Based on integrating the past with present senses into the sounds of survival, the brain is the conductor of our sensory symphony. This sixth sense, the cognitive conductor, helps survival by assessing physical and temporal distances as the mind recalls self-similar situations of danger or hope. In the movie March of the Penguins, the father returns to a cacophonous mass of young penguins with food destined for his own chick. 
From the masked chicks comes a bevy of noises within which the father focuses upon one that is his offspring. How? The Orchestra of Symphonic Senses for Survival. In summary on the evolution of senses, they evolve to promote stability by letting the organism find food or avoid danger at longer distances. Why has the U.S. suffered a decline? The math and science decline is fueled by an inflated self-importance in wanting something for nothing as believers in primitive religion. Matching the math and science low rankings is how the U.S. is ranked number 35 on not recognizing evolution over primitive religious beliefs. Are the provincial religious revealed truths dangerous to humanity's future? In the aftermath of the U.S. 2010 midterm elections, the leading Republican for the House Committee overseeing climate policy said the above, God help us! Another example of how believers are self-deceivers, which would not matter except the self-deceptions are killing all life on earth. Remember, the speed of light is rotational, not linear.